Lena, PA, Marana, they can just go hunting off the bat by the time they hit six, so. Spot Siphon is going to be there on Armel. He's in range for the fish, although it doesn't really connect with it, but now he's kind of stuck in that tree line moon. Still going after this. Armel, though, with the LSA and March is rotated in as well, and moon is Ooh. going to be the first blood. In fact, never mind, nobody gets awarded the first blood. They will give the first kill of the game away, and now, of course, Armel will just go deny himself over to the tier one tower. Pop a creeper to with a sacred arrow. It's not the safest time for a support to even just go for a pull up against that lane. The bottom lane, however. Moon. He has exorcism. He's looking to make a push down a bot lane. Fisher was there, but the Phoenix will, of course, Icarus dive away. Meanwhile, KP ends up killing off Savage again. Savage doesn't seem very happy with it. It's the second time he's died this game. They are, of course, going to push in that T1 tower, but TPs are coming in. Armel, he wants to try and get Moon for this. LSA does land with the Dragon Slave, and now Gabby blinks in, but a nice fisher from DJ. That'll block off the other two heroes from TNT, and now Moon, he wants to chase further onto Gabby. He doesn't have any Spirit Siphons. And that is going to matter, because Gabby will just be able to run away, but at least DJ will find the courier of the PA. There's a lot of rotations in from TNT, however. Moonlight Shadow, LSA though, not landing on Moon, so he's just going to run away now onto Armel with that Spirit Siphon. There's the egg being dropped right in the middle of all this. They're going to be able to burst that one down, or maybe not. No, they do find it, but Moon, he's in big, big trouble. He will end up dying on the DP as Savage. He'll try and chase Armel on that Lena. Can he actually find him though? Not quite. He'll go after Ooh. KP instead. Echo being committed to lock down KP, but he is so tanky on this Brewmaster. But now with the tree and block, he should be... Quite susceptible to going down and does. Ice, ice, ice. TP's away. However, nice cancellation from Tim's. Just being uh, an absolute pest on that Marana. Mid lane, however. Armel getting caught by the Fisher. Moon going to go in with the Exorcism again. Armel in big, big trouble right now. He will end up dying. Magic Missile and a swap Ooh. from Jab straight onto Tim's. That was a great swap coming out mid-leap. He does leap again, but he should end up dying here. In fact, Crypt Swarm is going to be enough from Moon. And Savage, wanting to dive a T3 tower. He does have time lapse, I suppose, so he could make that happen, but ultimately will back out of there. And of course, you do have the DP ultimate. And this will be a rather quick Roshan, but Tim's, he does scout it out with a quick arrow. Uh, that's a lot of damage on Moon already. This could be really bad for Fnatic if TNC do jump in. Moon just getting bashed to death, but that Roshan is so low, and it looks like TNC are unwilling to contest. Tim's, he did buy out a smoke, but he was just... It was way too late. So now the rest of TNC, they're just going to try and stay away from Fnatic and keep farming up. But Moon is making the chase right now. Uh -huh. Smoke from March. They're going to run straight back into Moon now. So Smoke is broken. KB, he gets silenced up. But there's the Moonlight Shadow. But Dust is out from DJ. Now the Sunray trying to heal up KB. Echo, they don't want him to split. He oh. will probably get it off. However, they just can't stun him long enough. They don't have the damage output. Now DJ will end up going down straight off the bat. And Savage, he's been stunned up. Laguna straight oh. to the base. And now Egg to be dropped straight off the ages does he get stunned not quite he gets out of range but gabby jumps in after jabs does find the venge savage still trying to fight back and here comes moon once again gabby who are you gonna aim for he'll go after savage savage will secure away meanwhile moon getting taken down he will die on the dp and this is looking really bad for Fnatic as that arrow going through not really connecting on anyone he has yeah. queued it up and he's making his way there but tnc they've smoked up Spotting out the side of Fnatic, but not breaking the smoke yet. Taking that high ground. Moonlight now. Moon going to be the real target here. They'll get the LSA with the Lagoon and they blow him up straight away. And the rest of Fnatic, of course, will not be willing to take this team fight without their DP available. We spotted out with DJ now. They do. Ice 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 going to jump in with the Sprout. However, KP jumps in with the split. There will be a swap out on DJ, but KP going to focus him down. LSA not connecting. There's a swap. Egg being dropped as well, but Savage taking care of it. But now Gabby, he will find the Weaver in time, and he can just clean up straight afterwards. Ooh. Finding jabs as well. Poor Ice 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 flying in the air. Moon has joined in with the Exorcism and his own BKB, but Gabby does not seem afraid. Or maybe he does. He wants to blink out of there. They definitely want to stick around for this Roshan. 
Moon blinking forward, but another blink away from the PA. Now the arrow from Tim's. They could turn on this, but Ice 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 taping in the back lines. Laguna there on Moon, falling very, very low, but Tim's does not connect the star fall. And now Ice 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 getting jumped on again by Gabby, but no lucky crits. Gabby just going to go in. Fisher going to be there with the Sprout. They have plenty of vision on what Gabby's up to. They're going to try and make the jump in while, as that Roshan goes down. But now the Egg is there and KP has jumped in. The Aegis has been given to Gabby. Jabs gets blown up straight away on the Venge. And now Fnatic once again wanting Ooh. to back up. But Savage, he gets crit on the Ooh. first hit from that PA. Gabby giving him the tip mid-team fight. Now Ice 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 trying to TP up at the Bash. They end up stunning him up. And that means that Ice 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 is also going to die on the Nature's Prophet. They blink in, oh. KP, looking for the split. They do oh. burst down jab straight off the bat, and now the Egg is there from the Phoenix and Gabby. He does find Savage with so many passions on that PA. Now onto Moon on the DP. He can't really survive this, or maybe he can. He'll try to run out of there, but they're going to lose DJ as well, and they're just sitting ducks right now. Moon is going to die, and Ice 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 the only man left standing, and he is not going to be standing for long. He will run for his life. It's going to be a slow kill onto Ice Ice Ice, but TNC, a full team wipe, and they lose nobody. Well, TNC starting to slowly make their way back up top, but Bash there on Ice Ice Ice, arrow to fly through as well, but doesn't connect. Now the swap in onto Gabby, but he just fights back. Moon, in fact, Jabs gets blown up. Now the egg right in the middle of the team fight. Who do they focus right now? Gabby jumping on the Weaver against Savage. He's in so much trouble, he will not die. They'll go after Moon instead. Jabs will buy back. Ice 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 about to die himself and will eventually go down. They'll try to follow up on Gabby, but he still has the ages. Savage coming back in. Gabby falling very, very low, but just not dying though. Oh. There's the Echo DJ. He does at least get the Aegis. Yule's up on that Earthshaker, however. They're going to punish him for that. Swap out from Jabs, but they are on top of him. There goes Savage. Gabby takes him out. Now Moon's going to be in trouble. A nice Fisher will delay things, but Gabby again oh. just critting through the daggers. And he can just clean up. He's going to find jabs as well. This man is critting on demand. And that is GG. Ooh. TNC pull off the first game victory. Fnatic would have been the favorites going into this. But TNC, at least for game one, have shown up. Arm LTA and, and Gabby Poz1 Ricky. And even the KP Brewmaster. That scares me a little bit for Fnatic. DJ just going to bide his time and just stick around here. Trying to wait for that perfect opportunity to, to be able to roll in. In fact, there it is. He oh. does roll in onto Tim's with the kickback on that Rubik. Tim's should just definitely be dead here. However, he is going after Jabs and maybe he does find him. But they find the first blood on Tim's first. Jabs falling just a second afterwards. Gabby does just get his treads up. But he is now underneath the sentry ward and immediately gets sprouted up. Roll in. DJ going to connect perfectly, though. They don't really have that much damage yet. Not without Moon. He will oh. rotate in now, but KP has joined the team fight. Again, straight onto Ice Ice Ice. The Skeletal War has been dropped, but Ice 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 is still in huge trouble from this primal split. And it looks like he will eventually just burn out here to KP. In fact, he'll just keep going now after DJ. Be with that. that help. Yeah, and, uh, Fnatic again expends a lot of heroes down bot to try to find... Gabby and get punched instead, although... Yeah, there's going to be a fight on that mid-river. Jabs will die immediately, but they do secure the march kill. But now DJ going to be in trouble. Gabby will be able to find a double kill on the Ricky. He won't for now. He might have to switch targets because the Roshan is under attack right now. Armel going for a very quick Roche with that fresh Desolator. Ice Ice Ice, of course, does scout it out, and now the traps are flying out. Moon bot lane does end up killing off Tim's. Ice Ice Ice, however, going to be in big, big trouble. He'll try to TP out of there, and looks like he could make it out, and he does. Jabs will lose his life to Gabby, however. First Roche going to go free towards TNC, and just based on how Fnatic do, do run, I think that takes away from some of their potency. Mid lane. Roll doesn't connect on March. You still have Moon around the corner waiting, and March will get jumped on, but Hand of God will be expended. Now KP just not using Primal Split yet. He was Sans. He does commit now. Ice 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 again going to be the priority target and does go down. And now the Tornado is there on the Earth Spirit. Savage showing himself, and he's ready to join the team if he needs to. But I think he may have to let DJ just die here. There is going to be a lift back. 
He will commit the Magnetize and the Silence. Now Moon will try and jump in and reinitiate for the team as Savage also waveforming back in. They do finally kill off March on the Chen before that Aegis expires. In fact, on top of that, Diffusal Blade now up on Gabby and he finds 23 Savage. Take the, ten the attention of TNC away from your Morphling because Savage still doesn't have anything. Went for the S and Y, which Oh, we don't tend to see a lot of although Getting surrounded right now, but Armel is there to help out. DJ pops the Magnetizer, and now with the Winter's Curse, it is on Gabby. He's taking a lot of damage, but Tricks of the Trade will be there. Armel still protecting Gabby, but he does eventually end up dying. Moon, however, will trade his own life away for that. Ice Ice Ice, oh. he will also die just before the TP ends up finishing. And now Savage trying to jump in by himself and fight the whole side of TNC. He almost does end up killing off March. Gabby... Goes in as well, they know where he is. Ice 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 gonna TP in, they dust him up with the Orchid, but there's Tim's stealing. Oh. Does he steal anything? No, he just fade bolts, but Gabby is surviving throughout all this. And well, Gabby, now Tricks the Trade will come out, he's starting to fall low. DJ to roll in as well, they'll go on the Rubik, but now here comes Armel. He's your real problem. Ice Ice Ice, Sprout TP out of there on the Prophet immediately. DJ now jumping in with the Magnetize and Savage to follow up on that Morphling. Trying to dish out the damage there onto Armel, but he is so tanky with Refraction. Now going into Meld, but they have Dust. Uh, Mel will die Ooh. and he has no Aegis left. Jams will also lose his life to Gabby, but that does not matter as much as KP also going to get caught out on the Brewmaster oh, now. No. And that is a huge couple of kills there for Fnatic. Ice 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 going to TP in, they must know something's wrong, and there's the dust coming out. Gabby again going to be the main priority target. Savage with the adaptive as well, it will all be enough. The Hand of God. But Fnatic do the same. Into KP. Smoke's going to be broken. He does morph into the Brewmaster. And now jumping straight onto March. There goes the Chen. KP. He will Brewmaster split up. Is it going to be enough to help out this time around? Doesn't look like it. Curse will be there onto the TA. So Armel being locked in. Now the smoke screen, however, straight onto Moon. He's in big trouble. Savage trying to help him out. But he kind of just runs in there with Ice Ice Ice. DJ. Magnetize is up, Moon's still alive, but it finally does end up going down at Gabby. Now Armel falling very, very low. That Magnetize still just ticking him down slowly, and Savage does find the kill. Now KP as well, no more Primal Split left. They do have a clumsy net, they lock him in, and it'll be a double kill coming out from the Morphling. TNT, of course, going to have to try and fight this to the best of their ability. KP going to run with Primal Split. However, there will be a Sans coming out. He's getting bursted quite fast, and it is going to be enough to take down that Brewmaster. Now the Winter's Curse is going to be out on Armel. Nice smoke screen out from Gabby, however. Sans in quite a few there in the Meld Strike. Will secure the kill on Jabs, and now the Stolen Curse is going to be there on two Ice Ice Ice. DJ, however, trying to chase down Gabby. Does find the kill on that Pos 1 Ricky. Meanwhile, Armel is... Just trying to run away here. More bounties being placed or being secured, rather. Buybacks flying out from TNC. Savage still looking very healthy as DJ runs back in with the Magnetize now securing March on the Chen. Uh, Mel will be the next target. He tries to just meld. It is not going to be enough, however. They have the detection this time around. And KB, he just brought back into this team fight, and it looks like it is going to be a dieback coming out on the Brewmaster. A triple kill coming out from Savage. Gabby will also be out of there. Or is he? No, he is not. They found him. Let's get caught out. And with that Media Hammer follow-up, he is just going to die. A lot of tips coming out onto Gabby. They do. Butterfly now up on Savage as well to make matters worse for the side of TNC. And this is going to be a very, very quick Megas coming out if TNC aren't careful about this. Great Media Hammer out onto two. March getting caught out there with KB who does end up dying. He has no buyback. March about to die. Hand of God comes out. It won't be enough. He'll die as well. And the GG has been called. And that'll mean our first series of the BTS Pro Series Season 2 is going to be, end up being a draw. A one-to-one -one between both these two.